Niner 305 Zulu, Cleveland Center, climb maintain, Niner 1000, Morgantown, Timber 300, Niner. 300, Niner, climb maintain, uh, Niner 1000, 305 Zulu. All right, everybody okay? 305 Zulu, you all right? Yes, sir. 305 Zulu, you with Cleveland? 305 Zulu, you with Cleveland? I can't hear you, but we're in trouble. All right, what do you need? What do you need? 305 uh, Zulu, follow your instruments. Follow your instruments, sir. All right, I'm going to... 305 Zulu, I do show you descending. Follow your instruments, sir. Trust your instruments. I'm following my instruments. What happened? I got in a real bad updraft. I don't know what happened, sir. You got it under control? Yes, sir. Roger, 05 Zulu, just get yourself under control. Evidently, I got into a bad updraft. I went way off. No matter what I did, it was still climbing, and then all of a sudden, it let go the other way. 05 Zulu, you're fine. You're fine. I'm showing you a level of 5,000 right now. Just, uh... I'm going to hold the 5,000 until <laughs> things slow down a little bit. Absolutely, Zero Five Zero. You just maintain 5,000. Just uh, whatever you need to do is fine. 5,000 is uh, good in that area. Just don't go any lower. Seven University. All right, Zero Five uh, Zero. I do have the Morgantown Airport at your uh, 10 o'clock in about uh, three to four miles. If you uh, needed to land That's or anything, sir. Uh, no, sir. We're good. I need to get back on course. Uh, that was a very bad experience. I, I can imagine it was over here on this end, too. So, Air, you yeah. might want to tell us pass that information on, that that is a miserable updraft right there. Yeah, we absolutely will. Uh, yeah, we have, we've have we had no, uh, no reports of that at all. Uh, uh, zero 05 uh, Zulu, uh, what yeah, altitude do you, you like right point. now? Uh, I'm going to go up to 7,000, and I think I'm going to be in the clear. I'm through whatever that stuff was. Roger, uh, zero five Zulu maintain seven thousand. Or three zero five Zulu, you don't have any uh, damage to the aircraft or anything like that, do you? Uh, the only thing that I see is my wing tip fuel door. Uh, the uh, fuel covers are open, but the uh, I'm assuming I don't. The, the uh, plugs are still in place. I'm not losing fuel out there. Roger, uh, sounds good. We do have, uh, you know, multiple airports around your area. If you do f uh, feel the need to uh, land, I've got that ton of options for you. Just let us know. Oh, Roger, I think what I want to do is uh, see how this handles right now. And the problem, I might just set her down here a little bit. I don't know. It's, right now, we're getting into some good, clear weather. Roger. Zero five Zulu, the, you, you encountered that uh, severe updraft there at, uh, at 8,000, is that uh, correct? And then you went up and then a sudden downdraft as well? Uh, yes, sir. How, how high was my altitude? Uh, zero five Zulu, it looks like you got up to about 8,500, and then uh, next thing you know, you're, you're down way low. Uh, did the aircraft stall on you? Yes, sir. Uh, it did. Uh, we were trying to control the climb, and then all of a sudden it just ran out of uh, airspeed. Uh, and now, and then all kinds of stuff went on, but I think we're all right. Uh, but I've never had that happen before. Roger. Yeah. Uh, I've never had that happen uh, on frequency either. Yeah. It's just, if you need to land and uh, just get everything sorted, that's uh, that'd be fine. We we got lots of options, like I said. Oh, uh, Roger. I think. Well, let me uh, let me get out uh, down here the road a little bit here. and us see. I'd like to get in the clear. And uh, then we'll go from there. Sounds good.